Hi everyone, Melissa here, coming to you today with a couple projects to share with you. I've been busy, busy, busy creating some uh, embellishments that I can transfer to cards or toppers or whatever. But today it's it's a card. But I was inspired by a lady on Pinterest that had made, she made a shadow box that had several different elements in the shadow box. One of them was a, I forgot the name of the chair, but it's the beach chair um, with flowers on it. And I was just like, I've never used a bench that I bought off eBay probably five years ago. And so that's where I got this die from. But anyways, let me show you all the things I used to create it. And then I'm gonna show you this in the card. So I'm using these gems I found from Hobby Lobby. They were like 41 cent or something like that. I'm using this paper again for my background paper there. Um, this is the um, stamp set that I got, the sentiments that I'm using, which will be this one and this one here. Um, my leaves in the background, actually no, the butterflies came from this here this and this, and I think that is all that I'm using off of there. There goes that bench that I got off eBay, when I say at least five years ago. Okay, and then from here I am using this leaf as well as this leaf and this right here. All right, and then from this die set, which is I don't know why, I think LDR, LDRS, I'm using that butterfly, and then I'm using the Alina Craft Flowers um, that she sent me for free, and then I'm using this outside die here that I picked up offline, oops, I got one more, and then this topper, there, all right, let me show you my creations, okay, got the card back there but I love this there goes my topper ah I thought that was just the perfect sentiment find a few moments to just sit back rest your eyes yeah I thought that was the perfect sentiment and like I said that came out of this set here that type of chair that is what she had she had a die for that type of chair and then um let me just take these out so I can show you a little bit closer. Oh my gosh, I just thought these turned out beautiful. I thought they just turned out so gorgeous. Anyways, I was inspired by her and I did them as this, but the whole time I was doing this, the image just kept on running through my mind to look like this. I thought it turned out pretty close to what I was thinking about. I thought it turned out gorgeous though. Really, really pretty. And that's how I packaged it up. Hopefully, I will be sending some of these creations to a friend soon, or two friends, a few friends. <laughs> but I uh, love the chair, how it turned out. Um, this color here is um, Salty Ocean, I want to say. This was the Distress Sink, um, which I had gotten the Distress Sink before I actually got the Oxide Ink, but the back is the Oxide Ink that I used there. And all of these are oxide or distress inks here that I used on those flowers. And then I also added some diamond stickles on there, there and there. And um, there goes that thankful for today. Oh, love how it turned out. I think this was the perfect dye to use back there. And I got that off, I don't even remember, somewhere offline. But, um, and then I, I just put that in the inside as well. But tell me what you think. If you like what you see, come back again because I have some more embellishments that I've been working on. Just not quite finished yet. Oh, my, be still my heart. Oh, I'm starting to really love now making embellishments. Uh, I, I just can't even explain to you how much I'm enjoying it. All right, so that is all I have for you. If you like what you see, give me a thumbs up, hit that subscribe button. Please comment, share, and yeah, that's it. You all stay safe out there. Have a blessed and crafty day.